Hi everyone, this is Karen. Welcome to Live Interactive English. Today we have a lesson on clothes test, and it's called taking the bean out of coffee. But to be honest, today's article does not really concern me because I don't drink coffee. <laughs> But I know a lot of people who do drink coffee, and a lot of people rely on drinking coffee every day to wake them up. So I kind of feel lucky because I don't like drinking coffee, so I save a lot of money every day. All I drink is milk tea from the breakfast shop, so it costs me like. 25 NT every day, but I know a lot of people who do like coffee, though. And today's article is also about you know being nice and saving our environment. So I guess you know it's worth looking at. Okay, so let's go into today's lesson. In the push for a healthier diet and greener planet. People have turned to products like fake meat burgers and soy milk. In fact, there is now a strong market for meatless meat and milkless milk. Could coffeeless coffee be next? One company in the U.S. thinks so, and it is creating coffee that isn't made from coffee beans. Climate change is forcing coffee farmers to move their crops to cooler areas. As they do, they damage the environment by cutting down forests. This led Atomo Coffee to look for a coffee bean substitute. It studied the chemicals in coffee beans because it wanted to recreate the taste, smell, color, and caffeine content of coffee with other ingredients. Today we have a lesson on clothes test, and it's called taking the bean out of coffee. Hmm, that sounds very, very interesting. I guess it's possible to make coffee without coffee beans, right?、Hmm, I really don't know. Let's dive into today's article. In the push for a healthier diet and greener planet, people have turned to products like fake meat burgers and soy milk. Okay, so let's go to the first part. In the push for a healthier diet, that means people are looking for different ways to eat and drink healthier. Okay, and a greener planet. That means we want something that's more environmentally friendly, something that's better. For our Earth, okay. So, in the push for a healthier diet and greener planet, people have turned to products like fake meat burgers. Okay, maybe burgers not using real meat; they use fake meat because we all know that you know eating real meat actually consumes more energy. Okay, so it's not as good for our environment. And people are turning to soy milk because soy milk is also very, very good for your body, and it doesn't consume that much energy. We're not drinking real milk from the cow, so soy milk is 豆浆 I love drinking soy milk, and it's good for your body. Now let's continue. In fact, there is now a strong market for meatless meat and milkless. Milk. So when you say there's a strong market for something, that means it's really popular. People, many many people, are looking into this. Okay. So meatless meat. That means meat without using real meat. And milkless milk is like milk without real milk. So I think another thing that's really popular now is. Oat milk. Oat milk is using making milk using oats. So some people like to drink it because they feel they feel it's better for your body. And a lot of people are actually putting oat milk into their coffee as well. Could coffeeless coffee be next? One company in the U.S. thinks so, and it is creating coffee that isn't made. From coffee beans, that is a great idea. Well, anything that's better for our environment is worth looking into. Now, climate change is. 
forcing coffee farmers to move their crops to cooler areas. Now we all know climate change, that means the weather is changing, right? Maybe because of pollution or something bad for our environment. So the temperature is rising, is getting hotter on our earth. So climate change is forcing coffee farmers, it's kind of making them move their crops to cooler areas. So maybe it's easier for them to grow their crops if it's too hot. It's hard for their crops to grow. Now, as they do, they damage the environment, okay? So when they do that, they're not doing something good for the environment, okay? As they do, they damage the environment by forests. Now, we have four options for this blank. The four options are A, carrying away, B, cutting down, C, building on, and D, getting off. Now, 在我们课文中提到, 气候变迁迫使咖啡农把作物转移到比较凉爽的地区。所以这一题的题目的意思是说, 当他们这样做的时候呢, 借由空格森林而破坏了环境。这一题是在考我们的片语动词。因为空格后面有受词forest。所以要使用及物用法的片语动词。来看我们四个选项, A, carrying away, 我们指的就是拿走或者是带走, B, cutting down, 我们指的是砍伐或者是砍倒, 我们指的也许是树木, C, building on, 指的就是在什么什么的基础上, 继续发展, D, getting off, 我们指的就是下, 也许是下车或者是下飞机等, 所以我们从语义上来看呢, 只有 cutting down forest, 最适合, 砍伐森林会破坏环境, 所以这一题的答案要选B, cutting down. The correct sentence is, as they do, they damage the environment by cutting down forests. This led Otomo Coffee to look for a coffee bean substitute. Now, when you say they're looking for a coffee bean substitute, they're looking for an alternative. That means they're looking for another option for a coffee bean, okay? So it studied the chemicals in coffee beans. It wanted to recreate the taste, smell, color, and caffeine content of coffee with other ingredients. Now we also have four options here to choose from. A, once, B, unless, C, although, and D, because. 这一题的题目的意思是说, 它, 它指的就是Atomo Coffee的这家公司, 它研究了咖啡豆中的化学物质。空格，它想用其他成分重新制造出咖啡的味道、香气、颜色，还有咖啡因含量。这题是在考我们的连接词。那我先来看选项A，once。当连接词表示一旦怎么样，就会怎么样，用来表达这是某件事情发生，另外一
Welcome back, everybody. So we're still talking about making coffee without using real coffee beans. So it's probably good news for our environment. Let's go back to our article and find out more. Atomo discovered that certain plant materials had similar properties to. Of coffee beans. Now, when we say discover, that means to find out something new. And properties, that means it's the you know the characteristic or quality of something. Now we have four options here. A is that. B those. C one and D other. 这题题目的意思是 ，Atomo 发现了某些植物原料具有与咖啡豆相似的特性。那句子里面的 properties 指的就是特性。Similar 指的就是类似的、相似的。后面常常会接 to 加名词，表示跟什么东西很相似。那这个题目是在考我们代名词。四个选项分别是 A that, B those, C one and D other。从语义上来看，课文是要表达某些植物原料的特性和咖啡豆的特性相似。空格里面呢，要填入代名词来取代前面出现过的 properties， OK， 避免重复。properties 是复数名词，选项里只有 those 这个代名词符合用法，所以答案要选 B those。The correct sentence is. Atomo discovered that certain plant materials had similar properties to those of coffee beans. Now, discover is our vocabulary word, and it's a verb. Like we talked about before, discover means to find out something new. In our example sentence, Dr. Young discovered a new treatment for the disease. Okay, he found out a new treatment. For this disease, okay. And the next vocabulary is property, and it's a noun. When you say the property, in our case today, it's the characteristic and quality of something. In our example sentence, it says one of the properties of the material is its light weight. Okay. And let's go back to our article. To make a Tomo's green coffee. Seeds and other plant waste are run a special chemical process. Now, our four options are A through, B over, C into, and D off. 这一题题目的意思是，为了做出 Atomo 的环保咖啡，种子和其他植物废料要空格特殊的化学制成。句子里面的 run 在这里指的是进行或者是运作。这一题是在考我们的介系词。选项 A through 指的就是透过、借由。B over 可指的就是在什么什么的上方，或者是关于。C into 可指的就是进入什么什么里面。D off 指的就是远离或者是离开。那根据课文呢，它是想要表达。种子还有其他植物废料要经过特殊的化学制成，再透过我们需要透过这个化学制成来做出 Atomo 的环保咖啡。所以呢，在这里最适合的答案就是 A through. The correct sentence is to make Atomo's green coffee. Seeds and other plant waste are run through a special chemical process. Now, process is our next vocabulary word, and it's a noun. When you say process, it means a series of steps you need to take in order to achieve something. So, in our example sentence today, it says making a movie is a long process. So, it probably takes many, many steps in order to finish your making your movie. Okay, so let's go back to our rating. The result of the process is a drink that tastes less bitter than coffee. The company's coffee should hit the market later this year. Now we also have four options to choose from: A, moral; B, cultural; C, traditional; and D is environmental. Now, this question's meaning is that this process is a drink that tastes less bitter than coffee. 
、空格、咖啡。不苦的饮料，这一题呢是在考我们的智慧单字。那空格里面呢要填入适当的形容词。来，我们看一下我们今天的选项 A moral， 我们指的呢就是道德上面的。那 B cultural 指的就是文化的。C traditional 指的就是传统的。D environmental 指的就是环保的或者是环境的。Atomo 的咖啡不是用咖啡豆制成的。那课文的这个句子呢，就是要拿 Atomo 的环保咖啡来和传统咖啡的味道来做一下比较，所以最适合的形容词 traditional， 其他选项像是道德咖啡、文化咖啡、环境咖啡，语义都不符合，所以呢，这题答案我们必须要选的是 C traditional。So the correct sentence is the result of the process. Is a drink that tastes less bitter than traditional coffee. The company's coffee should hit the market later this year. Our next vocabulary word is bitter, and it's an adjective. It's like a kind of flavor or taste. So, for example, sometimes when you eat lemon, and then the seeds in the lemon are very, very bitter. And of course, we all know coffee is very bitter if you don't. At sugar. Now we have an example sentence. My daughter doesn't like the medicine's bitter flavor. Now we all know that medicine also tastes pretty bitter sometimes. Okay, so the last part of the article it says that the company's coffee should hit the market later this year. When you say something or a product is going to Hit the market. That means it's going to come on the market, and people can start buying or start purchasing this product. I guess that's great news. That means that maybe we can start buying this product later this year. Today we learned so much about making coffee without using coffee beans and some of the benefits too. Great news for everybody. I guess that's it for today, and we'll see you next time. Bye bye. In the push for a healthier diet and greener planet, people have turned to products like fake meat burgers and soy milk. In fact, there is now a strong market for meatless meat and milkless milk. Could coffeeless coffee be next? One company in the U.S. thinks so, and it is creating coffee that isn't made from coffee beans. Climate change is forcing coffee farmers to move their crops to cooler areas. As they do. They damage the environment by cutting down forests. This led Atomo Coffee to look for a coffee bean substitute. It studied the chemicals in coffee beans because it wanted to recreate the taste, smell, color, and caffeine content of coffee with other ingredients. Atomo discovered that certain plant materials had similar properties to those of coffee beans. To make Atomo's green coffee. Seeds and other plant waste are run through a special chemical process. The result of the process is a drink that tastes less bitter than traditional coffee. The company's coffee should hit the market later this year. Hi everyone, I'm Steven, and I'm Kim. And today we're at Taipei Zoo, and we're going to Bird, Bird World. World. Now, if you want to go to Bird World, there's an easier way to go uphill. You can take the shuttle train. The shuttle train station is near the Koala House. The fee is only five NT dollars, and you can pay with Easy Card. Let's go. This large dome-shaped cage covers around 3,000 square meters. The birds inside can move and fly freely. There are feeding plates along the tourist walk, which enable us to observe the birds closely. Look, it's a violet turaco. You can see many beautiful and precious birds here, including Taiwan's endemic birds like Taiwan blue magpies, Sun Ho's pheasant. And Mikado pheasant. Did you notice that in most cases the male birds tend to be more colorful? 
That's because they have to attract the female's attention. The female birds tend to be plainer so that they can blend in the natural environment to protect the baby birds. However, with parrots, both sexes are equally bright colored. That's because they live in rainforests and need bright colors to intimidate enemies. There is a display area for cranes. Don't confuse cranes with flamingos. They belong to different orders. Flamingos filter feed on plankton and algae, while cranes forage on small fish, frogs, insects, and plants. Look at them. Don't they look like rock stars? They are gray crowned cranes, the national bird of Uganda. There are up to 1,200 birds in Taipei Zoo from about 135 different species. Most birds are easily frightened, so when you come to visit them, don't chase them or feed them. Just keep calm and appreciate their beauty with love. See you next time.